I don't like the toxic pick versus thing. I think that is bad. Um, dual six is a great pick from Stink. LK is probably gonna go. He's gonna go one. Yeah. Okay. I don't think one will be too bad. I think that one might be close. I think dual three will probably end up being close, as most dual threes do. Uh, and then dual four. I guess you've got to give it to Stink because he's actually played it. But two and six should be Stinks quite easily. So you've got to win three of what will be somewhat questionable. Like LK is. I would say um, not favoured on any of these, but we'll see. He's a good player, he's really good in reflex, um, he looks better than me just based on this warm up. But I am I'm playing quite poorly today. Right. Yeah, I play poorly though mate. Oh, look, i got to tell Alan after the matches as well, now that he's out of the tournament as well. How do I? There we go. It's very rude, Chris. It's, it's very rude. Obviously. It's Me neither. They might. They might be able to. Here we are. Game one. I can be a proper caster at a proper volume. Praise the Lord on board with Sing Light Sock to begin. Here on, well, what I would have assumed was his favourite map, but it's LKO's pick, which, yeah, um, you know, playing to your own strengths is admirable. But I'm not too sure you'll get away with it versus Stink. Not a atrocious start, though. Well, the damage come out from Stink, but well, you know, he was bereft of items himself. Apparently, that doesn't matter for the time being, at least. Pretty much. Pretty, pretty much. And it's Tooth Stink already, that LG looking mighty fine today. What's up, percentage? 30, yeah. Online in Doombringer. I think I say it more, enough, ev more or less every stream. That's quite good. Anything above 20 is okay, honestly. We we'll don't want to hit less than 20, but above that you are gold. Still though, Stink, not in the commanding position regarding his stack. Okay, are getting on a lot of these items himself. He does have the mechanics to combat Stink, for sure. It's, it's not a total mismatch in that regard. Probably, um, yeah, given everybody that's left, I would say maybe Thrasher has a better aim, but only Thrasher. No, the no KO. Uh, Stink by far is the best. As he shoots the top stair. Cheers, mate. Cheers. And coming through here, LKO getting rather aggressive. Still going to be the Mega Force Stink, so it would seem. Might do the grenade. No. But I do like grenade usage a lot. You might well be surprised to know. I think it is quite underutilized in Doombringer for combat, for just clearing off an area. If you're going to enter a room, there's very little reason not to proceed it with a grenade. Oh, Stink bailing himself out in this game, you've got to say. He's not been playing solidly, but a win's a win. And it, well, he does this in all games, you know, this isn't like he's some subhuman player when it comes to timing uh, and, and control or understanding positioning. No, he can do it. It's just that this is the game plan that he carves out for himself. This is his niche. Uh, he puts himself against the wall sometimes and then just says, okay, roll your way out of this one. More often than not, though, he does. Uh, and he does use items as bait a lot. Looking a little bit rough for LKO right now. So I'm well, gonna hit his way onto a yellow light, and now fighting behind the pillar. Gets away. Not scot free, but close to it. Now, the issue with Stink is how do you ever bring him down when he has a larger stack? 
uh, the way I found to do it in our most recent games was let him discharge by accident. That was how I got rid of a 200-200 stack. Worked quite well. Does okay. I have the Jedi mind tricks to do it though. That LG. Let's have a look again. Yeah, only 23 now. Damn sight higher than LKO at the moment though. And that is... that's more than enough, so it would seem. Well, I hesitate to call it, but well, when someone is this idle and smooth, uh, it does mean to me that they've called it themselves. He's not quite going the full grenade strat, but he's got those funny mouse movements of a player that thinks it's over. In the lava, though, <laughs> surely Elkara can clean that one up. Not to be. Uh, that is quite disheartening. I did say that I thought Tox would be a poor pick for LKO. We'll see how he does on the other maps, and I would say they'll be closer um, th than this, his first pick, funnily enough. Maybe not aggressor. Yeah, I mean, well, I would have prepped Duel 4 and then picked Duel 4. I'm going to say I would have, because I might have to do it as well in the future, and I won't be doing that because I haven't prepped Duel 4, but... Uh, where are you going to get your edge? Duel 6, unlikely. Duel 2, unlikely. 1 and 3, intermediaries, uh, but Stink's still very good at them. Duel 4, nobody's good at. So. Yeah, well, that's never going to work out. I mean, it some, somewhat surprises me, because he likes Fuse. Not that it's that much like Fuse, or at all like Fuse, but it, you know, it's large like Fuse, so... Quite open like Fuse. Yeah. And surely, Sink has done enough at this point. To just ride this lead off into the sunset. Where he will wait quite predictably in grand finals. Grenades though. Oh dear lord, grenades. Okay. LKO, please. Turn this around right now. And make the entire three-man community rise up with vengeance against our Eggy boys. Please. Just, just for the soul. Losing track of stink there, though. Yeah, I think LKO must use quite low sense. He's quite precise, but a little slow when it comes to the really close quarters stuff. Which is the opposite for Stink. Stink's got a POV of a player much worse than he is, I feel. Like, if you didn't see him shooting anything, just the way he moves his mouse, it's, or it looks too frenetic. But now it works. Also means you have like a, a, a greater range. You're comfortable going anywhere from anywhere with your mouse. Yeah. This thing seems to be doing okay with that, though. Well, Christus, we've got two minutes of what are pretty much dead game. We watched a film last night at the Gothenburg Film Festival. It's called Columbus. What did you think? He doesn't know what to think about it. A lot of things to take in. No action, really. 
No action. Try to evoke a lot of what the buildings could with the cinematography, so it's pretty much a direct allegory going on there. Sing like Sock did take game one. As you will have known. A vote has been called. Vote passed. We can't put in another mic, alright? You just, you just calm down. We're going with one mic. One mic only. Unfortunately. Well. We could have. But here we are. <laughs> okay, versus Stink Light Sock on duel one. One. Fight. No, oh, hammer. Right. Yeah, he was. I wouldn't I wouldn't go so far in the second one. Uh Stink Light Sock. Blundering to begin with. We'll get himself on to that beggar finally. Now, chase down. Good damage coming from LKO. Answered back in turn, but... Well, I would assume that LKO is doing slightly better himself. A direct does make up for giving away the red, but... Not if you get fragged right after Stink hitting everything he needed to there. And you just hope this isn't characteristic of things to come. And on the one hand, it's very exciting to see this man escape the glass box underwater while in chains by the skin of his teeth each and every time. But it'd be nice to see some competition. Because honestly, I'm not feeling I'm going to be giving them any later. So it does all to LKO right now to make the man bleed. And I think he needs to do it somewhat early. Still low though. Still susceptible to some sort of aggression. Onto this red. Still. Get that weapon and a quick combo at the end. Seals the deal for the second frag of the game. What is that? What sort of what sort of plan is that? I'm gonna drop into the room, do a 180 rail while he's jumping up the jump pad, and then he will be so bamboozled that he won't aggress upon me. What, why does it work, Christus? Why? Pretty much. He 
he's always low though. He's always, it doesn't mean he dies. Doing the scrub jump. You can do this with a very, quite a, pretty easy actually. Just one circle jump. Yep. El Coe can do it, I know. I was about to say that all the items in the world won't save you, but apparently they will. You just need to put in a little bit more elbow grease with regards to your damage dealt. Okay, he finds himself a red. The crimson cuirass now adorned, as he will chase on through. Sing like Sock though, using the teleport to get some good damage himself, and now that Mega is not quite so free. Sing like Sock, if only he knew a better jump. Too low, too bold to jump that. Went for the rum up. And the run up, the rum up, the run up. The correct one. Yeah. Arena FPS games do tend to make you feel quite bad about yourself. So you so you wanna play as few as possible before your big match. That's actually Yeah. Well, you failed in that regard, but you've had some fun along the way. 4-4 now, LKO pressing his advantage as well. Surely, surely son, please close us out, don't let him onto a red. Uh, okay. It's, it's not pretty, but the job has been done. So they're just gonna win each other's map picks. Oh no, but surely Duel 6 was up next. But they're just playing LKOs. No, it was um FN esque. FN's the blank one. Mini layout mate, 68 kill. Page up. Uh, but I believe LKO pick two. Yeah, LKO pick two, Stink pick six. You have lost the lead. Oh, Stink Light Sick Decider apparently is what Al says. But okay. Yeah. Yeah, this is the decider, apparently, that they're just playing. Oh well. We'll just have to let it go? I don't know. Well, it was sort of up to them, I guess, unless we want to have an admin ruling. Yeah. Alright, let's just leave them to it. Whatever happens, happens on their heads, be it. Stink Light Sock does get himself in the lead once again. Narrowly so. Yeah. So I don't know why we've skipped Duel 6. But we have. It means it's a dual four decider. Yeah, it's best five bomb. It's a dual four decider with Arrowwalk and uh Arrowwalk and six still to play. If Sync goes two zero up, then it doesn't really matter what the order is. But if Elkair gets a win here, then he might be disadvantaged by the way the picks now work. I'm not too sure. In any case, we're still on Duel 1, and Stink Lake Sock has finally got the ball rolling in a serious 
a natural way for him. Has walked past that yellow. Instead, wants to aggress on this one. And it'll do okay. Gigi is called. And a well played from Stink Light Sock. A vote has been called. Oh, mana. We will go to. T, mate. T. How did you write die? Right, here we are on dual six. Three, two, one. We are on board with LK right now with his back against the wall. If he can win this and two other maps versus the reigning champion, then he will move on to the grand finals, lose this or the next one or the one after that, and he falls to the loser's bracket to face the winner of me and Thrasher already, though stink off to a good start, as is want to be the case on Duel 6. Look, just calm down. So, all to play for here, but it's not the map I would want to play for it on. Yeah, it's, it's, it's sort of, it's sort of horrible to play this map versus him. It's very demeaning. Yeah, but we are missing a mega platform here, Chris. Who needs things to work, eh? It's not what I'm here for. It's not what anyone watching this stream is here for. Sting does not give a monkeys about the fact that he's available. He will jump on up those stairs and say, get out, this is a 3-0. Uh, Sting, almost certainly, not that I can recall, but there's almost no way he's dropped a map so far in the league. And I don't think he'll want to start now. If he wins this, he will just be sitting pretty, waiting in those grand finals. And it's still, still rather textbook from him. Now, with this high ground in the yellow room, okay. Typically, the, the best fight in the entire game. Um, turns out Stink does die there, but a little after that, well, there we go. GG is called Stink Light Sock, will be in the grand finals. LKO awaits in the lower bracket, which means you're going back to Christus casting because I need to practice my German.